Hi, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to convert audio to text for free using three different methods and without installing any external software so you don't have to risk any kind of security, um, you know, risk getting a virus or anything like that. All right, so let me show you the very first method. The first method, real quick, is using Windows own internal speech dictation software. So you would type in the Windows key plus H. Okay. And this is what's going to happen. Okay. And from here, you would have to click this icon and it just would go ahead and type whatever you would say. Now, there's a little bit of lag between what you say and what is being typed. But other than that, it's pretty good. The other cool feature that you can do is you can edit while you're talking. So I can also add in things like period. Or I can just continue talking and say things like comma. And it would just go ahead and add it in. Right? Or I can just highlight certain words. And it would just go ahead and continue typing. So what I like about this feature is it's pretty bare bones, but it, it, does, it gets the work done. It's free. You don't have to install anything shady. So if you're using any kind of documents, PowerPoint, anything like that, you can go ahead and have Windows type for you. And <clears throat> it does a decent job. Speech recognition, what I found, is it, it's about 90% accurate. Uh, you do have to slow down a little bit in order to increase the accuracy. But all in all, I'm not complaining. You know, it's a free software. It does its job, and I don't have to. I hate typing, <laughs> so this definitely beats typing. All right, so that's the very first method to convert audio to text for free, which is the Windows dictation software. Once again, that's uh, Windows key plus H, and then you just click this icon. Hey, I've been getting a lot of questions again. I've mentioned in another video how to make money with YouTube using AI tools to automate my channel and to save time while building traffic. So, hey, if you're interested in how to make money with YouTube using AI tools to automate a lot of your work and to build traffic, uh, I'll put a link in the description and it will take you to the course where you can see how I do that. It's just there for people who are interested. So let's get on with the video. All right, let's move on to the second method. And the second method would be to use, because some of you would probably think this is a bit too basic, and I understand. So the second method is going to be a lot better, and it's called Otter All right, AI. And I re I'll leave a link in the description below just to make sure you're you're on the right one, you know, because it could be uh, copies and clones. Let me close out of, out of, the, out of this one. Okay, so from here, once you sign up and sign in, um, they give you a, a decent amount of of hours or time for the free account. It's not a fake free. Uh, you when you sign up, they actually give you a very very substantial free account. So you know you may not even have to upgrade. For me personally, I, I I just use a free one. It works for me. So once you're in here, all you have to do is click on record, and I'll like, give it permission. And then from here, you just speak like normal. So I'm just going to talk like normal, normal speed. There is no uh, punctuation. I just talk and it just uses AI to transcribe exactly what I'm saying. Uh, it has a lot of bells and whistles. This this one, what I like about this one is that the interface is really, really nice. And it has this cool feature. Let me show you real quick. So I stopped recording. Now it's going to get my notes ready it's going to process my notes and you know once it's processing i can go ahead and review both both the recording of what i said along with the transcription so this this is a great for like if you want to do transcription for videos or you know if you want to go backwards you want to take a video and kind of have it transcribed for you that's also another way you can do it this is quite a unique um tool because I find it, it's just really good. <laughs> Normally when I find software, or AI software, it has like a paywall, very limited free trial, and the AI is not that great. This one is a very, it's not like that at all. The free trial is really, really good. 
and the AI software is amazing. The only downside I would have is that uh, it's also the plus side is that it's a web-based software, so the strength of the software will rely on your internet speed. Now, let me go ahead and refresh this real quick. Okay, so the note's ready, and this is what you can do. You can just click on the transcript below, and it'll take you there right away. Transcribe exactly what I'm saying. Uh, it has a lot of bells and whistles. This, this one, what I like about this one is that the interface is really, really nice, and it has this cool See? feature. So it also has like a real. dynamic kind of like uh, captioning system going on here. And then it has a, even a summary of the keywords in here. So, I mean, this is if you if you do a lot of transcription or you just really lazy to type like I am, and you want something that's better than the first option, then I would highly recommend uh, you try out the software. I'll leave a link in the below. It's Auto AI. All right, and then let me show you the third option. The third option is some of you may or may not know. Let me go into here. It is actually. Okay, so the third method is using Google Docs. And this one is is quite easy. All you have to do is go into your Google Docs and from here you would go into tools and you would scroll down until you see something called voice typing or alternatively you can type in uh, control shift S. And then this icon won't appear, very similar to the Windows uh, software that we used and then you just click on this to speak. So I'm just gonna go, oh, then you have to give permission. So I'm just going to speak in normal time to see how well it can pick up what I'm trying to say. Uh, all in all, I find this to lag a little bit compared to the other softwares. It also is also a web-based software, so uh, the strength of the dictation software is based on how well your internet sp speed is. All right, sorry about that. Yeah, the... Uh, I forgot to mention Google Docs is free and it works well, but it doesn't work with Brave browser for some reason. Uh, I'm using the Edge browser to demo this. All right, so let's try that again. So basically, you would just click this icon here and you would just talk like normal and it would just go ahead and transcribe everything you just said. You can add punctuation marks like comma, period, next line. All right, and there's no training that you have to do with certain softwares in the past where I, I purchased, uh, I think with, it was Nuns or Dragon Speak where I had to, I think it was like for $80 and I had to train the AI or I had to train the software to recognize my voice in order to increase its accuracy and it would be just as good as Google Docs is right now. So <laughs> uh, Google Docs is amazing free software that you can use to basically very similar to Windows software and once you're done you just click this icon right here All right and the benefit of this software is it has also grammar checker so you can go from here you go to tools oh sorry right here there'll be this like a with a little check mark and you click that and it, it has a little spelling and grammar checker All right? and uh, it's not that great yet. It's it's kind of like Grammarly ultra light, but it's better than nothing, you know. And it's free, so I I'm not complaining about that one. So those are the three softwares that you can use to convert audio to text for free. For those of you who are just who need it for whatever reason, whether it's uh, freelancing gigs or whether you're creating content, and you don't have the money to kind of afford the premium tools, I I would recommend using these tools. Uh, to you know, basically hold you over until you can afford the uh, premium tools. And you know what? For, in this case, I I would say uh, you know this might be a bold claim, but the difference between free free tools and paid tools is not that much. So you might as well stick to the free tools. Uh, and, and me personally, I I switch between Google Docs and Otter um, Otter AI. The, the Windows one, it's a bit too basic for me, but it's an option that I wanted to share with everyone. All right, so if you did find this uh, video helpful, it would mean the world to me if you can please hit that like button. I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and I will see you in the next video.